As we head into high school postseason play in boys soccer, one team has stood out from the rest, but it's not a school from the beach. Chris Reckling tells us how a school in Chesapeake has separated itself from the rest of the pack. The boys soccer team at Grassfield High School is rolling into the postseason as the team to beat in Hampton Roads. The Grizzlies are undefeated at 14-0 and have outscored their opponents 56 goals to two. It blows my mind, honestly. Um, the leadership in the back with Nathan Burning, who's the conference player of the year, uh, Chris Voltz, Brandon Jones, Chase Quinn, they're, they're our starting back line along with Nick Evans and goal have just been fantastic uh, defensively and just shut down everyone. We, we, we don't, not only do we not give up goals, we barely get shot on. What we're looking at, we're gonna go ahead and run uh, three 15 minute games. Last game's gonna be seniors versus underclassmen. First year head coach Zach Calder knows how lucky he is to have an experienced team his first season coaching high school soccer. It's 12 seniors uh, and 13 underclassmen, so very solid group, uh, the guys are uh, full of leadership, a bunch of leaders on the team. We have four captains that were selected by the team. At the start of the season, this team knew it had what it took to be special, but the secret is out of the bag. It's not a secret anymore, for sure. Um, might have been initially, um, and because we're not a Virginia Beach school, the, be the beach district, the beach schools get most of the, most of the publicity most of the time, um, and being a Chesapeake school, um, we are sometimes under the radar, not the case anymore. Even though the Grizzlies have had their way with teams in the regular season, the players understand for this season to be really special, it needs to continue in the postseason. We're in the point of the season where it really doesn't mean anything because Friday we could lose, we're done. So, got to keep up the uh, mentality. Now that the conferences are made, it's not a first team just automatically bid to region because if we lose one game right now, then we're out of the out for the season. That'd be a big disappointment being number one in the region right now, and we want to keep up our reputation and keep up our win streak. Oh, we're very confident. Every game, we we think that we're going to win. In Chesapeake, Chris Reckling for the Sports Wrap.